hard, it's a hard road to navigate. Yeah. You know, you make mistakes and you give yourself a break if you make mistakes. Mm -hmm. I think that's really key. Hollywood Walk of Fame recipient, actress, activist, author, and full-time mother of four, Holly Robinson Pete, maybe 58 years old, but those are just numbers for her. Mom, like Nicki Minaj actually posted about you, like how does she know who you are? <laughs> right. You are. So, so that was kind of cool. At her age, she exudes the youthfulness and beauty of someone at 24, and she has been able to achieve all these by following a secret diet and workout routine. I like to talk about things that are not necessarily being spoken about, mm -hmm. just because if you see yourself going, oh, wait, that sounds like me, it gives you an opportunity to do something about it. In this video, she'll be sharing it all. So if you want to look half your age, then listening to these health tips from one of Hollywood's most successful actresses that seem to never age may just be your ticket to reversing your age and living a life of youthfulness, even in your old age. We're both wearing Sergio Hudson. We both look fabulous right now. So watch till the end, because some of these tips will leave you shocked and surprised. We, Lord knows we've been through some stuff, so we just felt like it would be great to counsel them and talk to them. According to Holly, breaking a sweat at least four times a week is the key to maintaining her slender physique, and she loves to mix things up to keep the excitement alive. From hitting the gym to enjoying outdoor activities and even playing with her kids, Holly's approach to staying fit is both fun and effective. When it comes to the gym, Holly is all about variety. She embraces a dynamic workout routine that includes cardio, weights, and yoga. By keeping things fresh and diverse, she ensures that every session is stimulating and enjoying while effectively sculpting her body. But it's not just the gym that gets her heart racing. Holly finds inspiration in the great outdoors, especially when she climbs the stairs at her local university. As the track team practices nearby, she draws motivation from witnessing the dedication of people half her age. It's these energizing outdoor workouts that keep her spirit high and her body in top form. Have you ever sent a sexy text to the wrong person? Uh, yeah, so what, <laughs> because my son and my husband have the same name, so. <laughs> One activity that truly brings this mother of four joy and helps her bond with her children is bouncing on the trampoline with her kids. Their shared moments of laughter and excitement on the giant trampoline not only create unforgettable moments, but also provide a fantastic workout. Holly admits that before she knows it, she's catching her breath and feeling the burn, all the while strengthening her connection with her kids. I play Dr. Lord, an autism doctor, and I mean, my kids thought I got an Emmy, Grammy, Oscar, and Tony lately. Yoga has been Holly's saving grace, especially after giving birth to her four children. This ancient practice has played a vital role in helping her body bounce back after pregnancy. Postpartum yoga became Holly's go-to exercise, providing her with the perfect remedy for nurturing her body and mind. To make her workouts even more enjoyable, Holly embraces the power of music, audiobooks, and classic tunes. From soothing melodies to her favorite jazz and R&B tracks, the nostalgia and rhythm keep her motivated and moving as she sweats it out. It's the perfect fusion of fitness and joy. I don't want to take this suit off. I don't think my mom wants to take this dress off. I can't get it off. Well, that that's, that's something. <laughs> um, but. When it comes to a diet, Holly says that she has an internal battle with sugar, which makes it impossible for her to cut it out of her diet fully. So instead, she balances it out by treating herself on the weekends. But from Monday through Friday, she limits her carb intake and eats more vegetables and proteins. She also takes a lot of water and fiber. Her breakfast consists of oatmeal with raisins and a little brown sugar. Holly and her kids love to eat goji berries covered in chocolate, strawberries, and air pop popcorn. She also loves taking green juice from kale, apple, and spinach, and according to her, they are all great boosts for energy. For dinner, Holly eats her signature meal, which includes salmon, asparagus, and a big green salad. She and her family love to eat healthy treats, such as the Vegan Rob's brand of Brussels sprout, beet, and cauliflower puffs. And according to her, she likes them because they're spicy, crunchy, and good for the body. For snacks, Holly prefers to have popsicles made out of fresh fruit and frozen grapes. And according to her, this combination is so delicious and it makes you feel like you're having a treat without the guilt. I look at this and she's got a nice food. I'm seriously Holly is addicted to a soothing eye patch routine and she takes it very seriously. Speaking on this, she said, I'm obsessed with under eye patches. 
My favorite is Golden Snail Hydro Eye Patches by Pedifee. And if my eyes are puffy or I'm feeling tired, I put them on and in 30 minutes, I look awake and glowing. You know, it was very cathartic to help others when you're going through something. Um, and so Holly Rod came along and really um, helped us help others. When asked about her motivating factor to stay in shape and why she follows her diet and workout routines religiously, Holly said it is because of her kids and that she stays in shape so as to set a healthy fitness example for them. Stress elimination is another key factor that propels Holly to stay on track. According to her four kids, when this mother incorporates exercise into her routine, she's less likely to raise her voice. As a full-time mother and businesswoman, Holly understands the challenges of balancing multiple responsibilities. That's why she prioritizes her workouts to keep stress levels at bay, recognizing that her overall well-being directly impacts her ability to navigate life's demands. Question game so that they will put their daggone phones down and, and do connect. Too. In Holly's world, taking a stay sane day is non-negotiable. This means setting aside time for oneself and her personal favorite is indulging in a rejuvenating spa day. As a devoted mom and wife, Holly often puts her own needs on the back burner. But when she allows herself these moments of self-care, it opens up the core of her mind and revitalizes her mental health. Even just an hour of quiet time makes all the difference in her ability to juggle and maintain balance. Each morning, Holly has a singular focus to begin her day with peace. For the past two years, she has practiced daily meditation using the Calm app before even getting out of bed. With each day having a specific theme, Holly immerses herself in the soothing guidance, setting her intentions, and starting her day in a tranquil state. In a world filled with stress and negativity, this ritual is her secret weapon for finding inner peace and fortifying her mental resilience. Surprisingly, tea plays a significant role in Holly's stress relief strategy. She has discovered teas infused with lemongrass or ginger provide the perfect balance to calm her senses. Sipping three or four cups throughout the day, along with her morning meditation, helps her to stay focused, be a better mom, and maintain a balanced mindset from morning till night. When stress starts to creep in, whether due to a demanding movie role or the chaos of her kids, Holly turns to deep breathing exercises or sneaks in a quick nap. She knows that a midday nap works wonders for her overall well-being, setting the stage for a more successful day. At night, Holly and her husband indulge in the soothing rain sounds offered by the Calm app, paving the way for a peaceful sleep. These seemingly small practices accumulate, creating a lasting sense of serenity in her life. Shout out to Leela, she introduced yes. us, right? Yes. Every time we get in a fight or something, I call her, it's your damn fault. <laughs> but anyway. Among many things, Holly is grateful for her cherished family, beloved friends, and of course her adorable dogs, all of which she lovingly documents in her gratitude journal. This practice not only helps her unwind and find solace, but it also fuels her passion to achieve more in life. Driven by a deep-rooted desire to inspire and assist others, Holly and her husband Rodney founded the Holly Rod Foundation, and this was in honor of her father's battle with Parkinson's disease and their son Rodney Jr.'s journey with autism. Since its inception, the foundation has grown exponentially, becoming a beacon of hope for those affected by both conditions. With a mission to raise awareness and support research, Holly's relentless dedication shines through in every endeavor. Reflecting on the foundation's impact, Holly shares, I want to illuminate the realities of Parkinson's. My father faced it in the 1980s and the 1990s when there was a lack of information. But now, with my brother's recent diagnosis, we have more resources and support, and he's thriving. Through their foundation, Holly and Rodney are determined to shed light on the evolving landscapes of Parkinson's, offering hope and improved outcomes for those navigating this challenging journey. But Holly's advocacy doesn't stop there. She is also deeply committed to changing the narrative surrounding autism. With a resolute passion, she wants the world to understand that autism is not a disease, but a disorder. Her focus lies in creating opportunities for young adults on the autism spectrum, striving to secure meaningful employment for them. Programs and our services, and we're looking forward to reaching thousands of underserved families across the country to provide compassionate care during their time of need. Over the years, Holly has personally facilitated countless job placements for those with this disorder, empowering them to unlock their potential and contribute to society. Where young people with autism can go and get the skills they need to be in the workforce. 
by sharing her personal experiences and dedicating her time and resources, Holly Robinson Pete has become a beacon of hope, compassion, and change. They're around with the different speech programs. Right. It really helps autistic kids to advance. Thanks, Thanks Holly. Holly. Through her gratitude practices, advocacy work, and unwavering commitment to empowering others, she serves as an inspiration to us all.